My area of concentration for the final was Disney and sort of like Disney in real life. So for my second painting, I took a scene from the movie Enchanted where the main character, who's a princess, was like transported to New York City from her fairy tale book. So she, she was like dressed up as a princess and in New York. So it, she was like out of place. And that's how I got the idea for this painting. And then I also wanted to add something to make it interesting so I did atmospheric perspective which is what I'm going to show you how to do now. So first you start off with a horizon line which is the line you see in the back which is about where the horizon would be and then the dot in the middle is called the vanishing point which is what all the lines sort of go to to like put things into perspective and so the this was taken a little bit after I started I didn't take a picture of the first of before I painted it or anything, but all I did was paint the background in clouds. So then I started drawing the, I started by drawing the horizon line and then the vanishing point, and then I started adding more buildings, which is what you can start to see here. And the front of the buildings don't go to the vanishing point, and they just, they're drawn normally, but the sides of the buildings go to the vanishing point. So the tops and the bottoms of the windows go to the vanishing point. So when I started this, I drew all of the buildings first with all the windows and all the details, and I didn't really think about the fact that I would have to paint over it later. So here's me painting over the windows because I didn't really think about drawing them first. So then as I started to finish more of the buildings, I added a line, which you can see more on the front buildings than you can on the back ones, that separates the side of the building from the front of the building. So you can see how the windows on the sides of the building seem to be more tilted, because that's where they go back to the vanishing point. And also the lines on the street go towards the vanishing point too, and you can see them disappearing into that middle spot right there where the vanishing point was before. And then this is the end product with everything sort of drawn together.